What is up, Nerf Herders? We are back after a very long and schedule conflicty absence, but we've got it all worked out. Gerald is actually here. If you've been listening to the podcast or seen, I don't know, how many trailer reactions did we do with that? We did a Just couple. One? I think yeah. you did the Joker one with that. Well, and then we did the podcast, podcast yeah. Yeah, we podcast. did Joker and a podcast. We did a Not couple too podcasts. Much, but mm-hmm. but, uh, but you're back. I'm back. Your schedule yes. is going to be easier for us to cooperate with. Right. Yours is. Yep. Mine yep. is, hopefully. <laughs> Things yeah. kind of slow down a little bit we're, for we're gonna, all we're of our jobs get back this time on track of year. To the so point mm-hmm. where we're actually consistently right. Yeah, hopefully. I'm and admiring the original trilogy of posters you have I on know, the wall right? here. This so is gonna wrap those up, apparently. Uh, hopefully, in a good way. We'll see. Because <laughs> uh, I've been so many fanboy outcry. Oh, dude, I I've think. I've been like avoiding spoilers as much as I possibly can, uh, yeah. and I, and as our viewers already know, we don't do any like background research on movies that we really want to see uh so like we're, i'm not reading up on any like leaks or behind the scenes crap or, right yeah or i'm not it. watching interviews with cast members if they if they're right gonna, i don't even know if there have <clears throat> been any the only thing point. i like, know I, I, I avoid it as much as humanly of, like, possible new characters and stuff is because toy hunting and they've released some of the yeah, new, yeah i have seen some pictures new of new characters, characters but, but they haven't again, been in any of the trailers yet but so. the thing though too is that some of them are from the new video game that's coming out oh yeah mid november i have seen the poster and the poster has like some people in some masks that i don't know yeah. are the characters but... from the video game i thought the video game was uh is like pre new hope it is and it's so it, they're it, gonna be some old characters to be, that... well new or droids new to uh, to most people yeah characters yeah um yeah. because it's gonna be after ex they execute order 66 Okay. Well, what are we expecting to see in this trailer? I I want to I want to see a plot, but uh, before our technical difficulties, we were talking about like we were talking sort of how you don't think there's going to be no. anything new. No. I this is I mean, it says final trailer, and I to I mean, just my opinion, I don't think we've actually had a trailer yet. No. I think we've had a lot of teasers. That last one, the majority of it was footage from the previous films. And that's usually a sign that they don't want to release too, too much yet. And this says, literally, it says final trailer. So I feel like JJ's just playing it close to the vest. I think we'll I get think. Some, some new scenes. Yeah. But not anything that's going to be like, oh, that. Yeah, I still don't even know what the plot of the film is. And I don't think we're going to know by the end of this thing. Yeah. And honestly, I've been liking mm-hmm. that movie trailers have been keeping away from that. So far, like, I, like, I like a, a lot more hype. recently. I like him more as hype videos than necessarily like yeah. trailers. Well, JJ has always been story. about that, so I think you know he did really well with uh, Star Trek uh, when he brought that out. I thought he did okay with Force Awakens. Um, I hope he learned some lessons from that. And even though he said he's not cleaning up the Last Jedi, I think a lot of people are like secretly hoping he's yeah. going to do that. <laughs> so, really like like. I didn't. I didn't hate Last Jedi though. So I, I um, did. So let's uh, let's let's <laughs> just play it. I just want to see some pretty stuff. Yeah, let's let's jump in here. Seth is biting at the bit. I can't wait any longer. Can't mm-hmm. even push play. He's so excited. <laughs> <laughs> wait for we stop. Here we go. Here we go. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Yeah. Oh. It's an instinct. <laughs> Who's talking? A feeling. Kind of sounds like Finn, but how does he know? Force it's not Force together. We're not Ooh, alone. Lando. Good people will fight if we lead oh, them. Rose is up and moving. Yeah, there's Rose. She's alive, people. That's cool. People keep telling me they know me. With the waves, it's like Frozen too. No one does. But I do. Entrance yeah. mode. <laughs> that was awesome. Ooh, that's Woo. Is that in space? That is awesome. Oh, it looks like space. Have I waited? And now There's the original ones right there. Yeah. You're coming to that is one hell of a bigger fleet than we saw last yeah. time. Yeah. Where'd they get all that fleet? Is your undoing. Boats! It's <laughs> almost like an interstellar shot. I like that. What, uh, what are you doing there, 3PO? Yeah, this is a new Taking character. one last look, sir, at my friends. Don't you kill 3PO! 
Didn't he have red eyes in the last one? Is he going evil? That must be, maybe those. Fear. Yeah. It's the destiny of a Jedi. That soundtrack. Your destiny. Yeah, Lando. Statue or something? Oh, there he is. The force will be with you. Always. The always didn't sound like Luke. No, that was clearly Leia. Yeah. That was definitely Leia. So you know we're gonna play this again. Yeah, right? we're gonna, uh, but we're not gonna do the discussion like we normally do before the second watch. We're just gonna jump right to. Just gonna go one. right back into it. Okay. Right back into. I'll it. try to be quiet okay. this time. There was I a lot couldn't of... hear anything you said anyway. Yeah, I'm so. sorry. <laughs> there was a lot of stuff that just kind of like I... they flashed it for a little bit, but it was like so exciting. There was a lot more in there that I thought was gonna be. Yeah. There. And I, I was. I, I still can't see a plot though. No, yeah, I but still, no. still can't tell of, what the plot is. A lot of sexy shots. All I know is that Ray is having to run from stuff with a lightsaber on her, seemingly on her own, a lot so far. Oh, there was like some things. Training droids. There were training yeah. droids. Fuck off, Alexa. Feeling. Shush. The force brought us together. We're not alone. Good people will fight if we the leave them. Alive. That is great. Look at that. People keep telling me they know me. No one does. Why are they going back to the Death Star wreckage? Long have I waited. And now. Big waves. What, uh, what are you doing there, 3PO? Taking one last look, sir, at my friends. Confronting fear. It's a modified soundtrack, but I like it. The music is fantastic. Ooh, wonderful. Saga will end. It's gonna end. That's clearly destroying that altar that he had to Vader. Yeah, yeah. The force will be with you. Always. You're right. That's that's Leia. Pretty good. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, now can we talk about it? We gotta yeah, talk about yeah. it. Oh man. So there's a <clears throat> they have a huge fleet now compared to like nobody showing up at the end of Last Jedi. So there's I th uh, like when I think it was around Star Wars Celebration that they said that there was a lot like cuz that was like the only thing that I that I watched. But I think there was a mention that there was a time jump, like a pretty significant time jump. Oh, I didn't I didn't hear that. Like, okay. I thought that I thought that was going to be the case that there was going to be several years that had, mm -hmm. well, yeah, that had the gone time by. Had passed. Well, I know, and in the last trailer, there's that shot of them coming over the hill to like Burning Man. So maybe this is like <laughs> everybody was camped out at Burning Man, and now they're back in their ships. So uh, yeah, if it's a time jump combined with everybody finally coming back together, it makes sense. I want to know why they're back at the Death Star. Well, clearly, that's the, where the Emperor has been hanging out. So maybe he called Kylo there, and then everybody else came there to finish him off? I don't know. Well, he had the um, Imperial ship that was rising out of the ocean. That looked, looked like, like it was coming out of the dirt. Like snow. Like dirt or, or something. Yeah, it was like... Was earth. that an ice, like, planet? Dead. Or was that a cave? Because it know, looked like it was in space. It almost it, looked like it was, uh, like, an iceberg... Well, right. I want to say that yeah. it was in space because the TIE fighters were all flying at it, like right. at, at its horizontal plane. Uh, yeah, yeah, and you didn't see a reflection of this of the 
like no. in water. So yeah, it so, could have been a cave. The first thing that I thought of when I saw that, <clears> and <throat> knowing that they're trying to go to the Death Star, like um, Kyber crystals were like wiped out by the Empire after Order sixty six, and after like during the destruction of the Jedi to power the Death Star and various other weaponry. They were like hoarding as much of it as they possibly could, and they kind of made a reference to that in Rogue One. Kind of like, but there was there's a planet in Star Wars lore called Ilum where uh, kyber crystals are harvested, like a lot of them. You're going and that's where, deep. You're going that, deep. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that's where Jedi would find their crystals. That's where Jedi would like harvest crystals to give off. To was it an ice like planet? That. It it wasn't an ice planet, but a lot of it was crystal. Like okay. there was a lot of like. So, so I would assume a... that 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 cave there was almost like the core of the planet or something like that, where it's made out of kyber crystal or something like that. That'd be crazy. That'd be and cool. they're like, they're, they're going to that place to like harvest more so they can make mm-hmm. more super weapons mm-hmm. and stuff like that. Yeah. And they, and they're going to the death star to harvest some sort of like super power part. Like the good guys are going cause they need a powerful weapon of their right. own to kind of like combat all the stuff that's mm-hmm. been going on. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's, that's definitely an interesting theory. It's like, I mean, there's, there's it's super reaching. <laughs> like, right. It's super hey, they, reaching. It's stuff. not out of the yeah. realm of possibility. They though. pulled it from, and JJ yeah. likes to pull, you know, deep stuff, you know. So yeah, I can see it happening. Let's talk droids. There's a new droid. There's another new droid. A little dude with that, the funnel cone. Yeah, thing, yeah he looks like What's he has a Dio? fast food cup for a nose I think, I think, or something. I, remember, or, I remember seeing him, but. Honestly, Star Wars Celebration feels like it was so long ago now. I didn't really follow Star Wars. So well, I, I, I watched it waiting for the trailer, but I had it on in like the background oh, okay. because because again, I didn't want to pay attention to too much. I didn't want like right. I didn't want some sort of a leak or something like that. Or in that same scene, you see another person with like a helmet on. She looks like a mm-hmm. looks like a you know Trinity type person with a motorcycle helmet. So when they when they were riding the creatures, somebody some chick was leading the pack. Oh, maybe it's but the it same wasn't person. one of the main characters. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a so many to sit in. At first, I thought they were on yeah. tauntauns, but they, it looked like it had they, four yeah, limbs on like it. So space horses. That's what I'm gonna call them. Right, space horses. Uh, C3PO still has his regular eye color in this trailer. And he's, is that a, did the voice actor die? Because it sounds like a slightly no. different voice. No, Anthony's still alive as far as Why I know. Why does it sound different then? It sounded weird to me. Maybe just better maybe, audio. Yeah, maybe the audio maybe. technique or something. So he's he like, did kind of sound a little like less he had droidy. A little, he had a little he more did. emotion. He did. He like, sounded more almost, like British. <laughs> well, that, well, he's, I know, well, he's I know, British. but he's well, British and all of them, really. as much, yeah. It sounded like it was less robot, more human. Yeah. Almost that, like he, and then he said friends, and maybe that saying, maybe that little gremlin that was working on his face like I, adjusted his audio. I thing feel or like I've like forgotten that. a lot of stuff, but did did C three PO hang out a lot with this group in the last two movies? Not really, no. Wasn't he more with like Leia and them? So why is this core group his friends? Unless there well, is a time well, jump. I'm, I'm sure. With I'm sure he knows Poe pretty well. Oh, like, yeah, because Poe was pretty po big was in, with the, the... in the Resistance. Okay, I'm sure. I'm sure R2 was somebody that he was also referring R2 to. R2 is like, hey, I got this friend. Can you tag along? And with I guess us? all of his other friends are dead, or like, his memory was wiped. So they're teasing that he's gonna die. I think that's what they're wanting to portray here. But I don't think or that's the case. Or sacrificing himself to a greater cause, like the I can um, the Resistance's cause. I want to think that it's a little bit less intense than that, and to where he's doing something that might fry him or something like that and so he's like oh i just want to take one last look at my friends and they're like no you're yeah. fine. you're gonna be fine whatever well, and then the, he comes the thing out was doing he's... something to him so maybe programming yeah, him for like something he, he or... looked like he was harnessed into something well maybe he comes back maybe. out and he's got the red eyes and all that That's stuff possible. like they're programming with some sort of like imperial protocol or something like that so he can yeah. like, help them he's first. been the thread that's connected all of the movies i mean i feel like sometimes he was shoot in there but He's been in every single Star Wars movie, yeah. or at well, least the main numbered films. The, so the droid that from uh, Solo that I can't again I can't can't think of her name, but the one that sacrificed herself mm-hmm. and one, yeah, and basically linked up with the Millennium Falcon, yeah, for the navigation. Maybe right. he's doing something similar to that where. Maybe my my watch thinks that I'm on a workout. Okay, that's how that's you how are, hard, that's how hard my heart's your heart pumping. Here. <laughs> what else? What else did we see? You in really this? look like you're gonna spontaneous. Dude, we finally see her doing some music. training. Yeah, she's <laughs> took three films. She's doing some training now. Well, she was kind of doing some training in 
the last Jedi, like she's kind of like teaching herself. And teaching also. herself. But it was clear that yeah, <laughs> there were some training droids. Yeah, which is cool. She's doing some doing some cardio. So, a lot of ice stuff. We didn't see anything of that desert planet from the first teaser. We which, saw another moment where she and Kylo are together and not fighting. Right, and, the, and they're yeah. like destroying yeah. the, altar the altar that altar. was clearly the, the, the Vader pedestal thing. that Vader's helmet was you on. You can see his yeah, helmet on the top. And, so are they coming together again? And then you, you hear Palpatine saying that your coming together will be your, I think undoing. it was be your end or you'll be your undoing. Demise. Like that. Or demise. So it, yeah. Don't get together, you're all going to screw up. Like, maybe they're, I, I can see that, that conflict <clears> between <throat> them two. Like, Kylo's still wanting to be towards the light. Like, still being tempted towards it. Especially after finding out that his <clears throat> mom dies because she's a force ghost or she's talking telepathically, but... I imagine she ends up being a force ghost here. I'm really excited to see what role he's going to play in this. And I just hope it's, like, fulfilling. Because I feel mm -hmm. like we all got let down when What's-His-Face got killed in the last... I can't even remember his name. Who was the... Snoke. When Snoke got killed in the last one, just like that. You know, it was like, oh, okay, he's out. If It kind of feels like they're bringing back the big bad from the original trilogy to be like, hey, we still have bad guys here. Here, here's for the payoff, and I hope it's not just like the last 20 minutes of the film. I hope he actually has a big role in this, and he's not just thrown in there so that they could have a bigger villain than Kylo. I kind of, I kind of foresee that Palpatine hasn't lived, and that weird droid creature, or like that, like Snoke got cut in half. Maybe he had to get attached to some crazy machinery to stay alive, but like he planned that all along. Like he or wanted maybe. that with Kylo to kind of like try and push Kylo towards more evil and like by taking over this because that's always been the sith or maybe it was a life model decoy <laughs> and, uh... but that's always been the sith code is that there can there can only be two and the apprentice must always kill the master if he wants to get anywhere like if he wants to move up in power at all like he has to like the weak in the sith always but, have but to again, die again you're 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 referencing things that weren't in the films so whether or not that was the sith code yoda said it in episode one always two there are a master and apprentice, no more, no less. When he was talking oh, about really? the Sith, huh? Yeah, he says that to uh, Mace Windu, I think. That's interesting. That's kind of dumb. <laughs> There's, there can only be two bad guys. Hey, you know <laughs> when when they said that Anakin was going to bring balance to the Force, he wiped out a lot of Jedi yeah, to make it beat around. Yeah. There's only a few yeah. left. Okay. Well, so, brought it down to a couple Jedi. There's only a couple Sith left. It worked mm -hmm. out in their favor. Mm -hmm. Anything else? We we see a little more Lando. He's flying again. He's he's got his ship back. Yeah, I really hope they don't kill him. I'd really like it if they didn't just kill off every member of the original cast. You know, speaking of what you were talking about with Solo, do you think they're gonna reference that in this film with Lando like talking to the ship like I miss you, baby? Think they're gonna I reference wouldn't that? Wouldn't shock me at all. He's got to be great. Like, or, or I mean, the or Solo's they... it's considered canon now. It is. So, I mean, yeah, they. I feel like they should. He should definitely have like a moment alone in a closet on the ship. <laughs> Getting his cape. Well, he could talk. I mean, he could talk to her all the time. Like, Nobody uh, would find it weird. I missed like, you. You know, yeah. pilots always talk to their ships. It's weird. <laughs> right. They just kind of go for He's it. He's like, can I just have a minute in the cockpit alone? Right. You know. And <laughs> hopefully, he doesn't have a moment. Steamy windows. <laughs> <laughs> he was in there with you, just me and the ship. Yeah. A rose. Well, mm -hmm. uh, December of rose. Did you see her? She was running through there. Yeah. Yeah. So everybody yeah, saw Rose where in that she's first been. one. She was up and walking around. Yeah. Although she wasn't, she wasn't in any of the shots with the with the main crew. The shot when they're coming into the cockpit, she wasn't in that shot. In the shot with her was like two other randos. So I wonder if they're just like. Well, I hope JJ is her like. Out. I hope JJ is like. You know what? That love triangle shit ain't gonna work. We're not gonna. We're not gonna do that. Love triangle. And he and so Finn is just trying to like stay away from Rose as much as he possibly can. <laughs> He's be like, no, I'm after Rey. That's not how this is gonna go. <laughs> like you saw Finn on the Death Star, surrounded by the water. It looked like he was clearly like shouting Rey. Yeah, yeah. Trying to get I think her they're abandoning like that. that. I don't think that was a. Th yeah, I wonder if we're gonna see that. Uh, hey, look, you're just we're just not compatible, and then they it's separate. Like, I didn't and like you at all. I'm just not gonna reference that. You kind of you kind of ruined last film. You kind of ruined my character's and arc ending really yeah. well by sacrificing way. myself. So uh, you know what? You're just not great for. We're just I not hope gonna work Finn out had something to do in this because that yeah. was the moment in the last film. I'm like, oh, Finn is stepping up. Yeah, and like then he... she robbed him of that. So I hope he has like. 
another moment in this film. It was like the one thing that he that he had was that he hated the First Order, and he wanted to get away from it, and like he just didn't feel like it was right anymore. And somehow and then she he's was given able an opportunity to come back to... from a football field away to stop him. Yeah. I don't get how that happened. And but... not kill both of them yeah. through the. I mean, Straight up T-bone them and they still lie. I mean, people get <laughs> people break necks and stuff like that all the time in like three mile an hour car right, accidents. They, right. they went through that just fine. Well, there's a lot of excitement about this. December 20th, who's got tickets? Uh, I haven't gotten mine yet. They just opened oh up my God. recently. I bought, I, I bought them like Monday. We're trying to like see them together. Like oh, we, we, had to, we had to we had to talk about <laughs> seeing the film, buddy. He's like, I've seen it open night. I don't give a shit. Yeah, that's well, right. We, I mean, we're day, grabbing though. something for opening night. But There's we're just a to go at IMAX. The same time. That's where we're going. Sorry. You you have fun at your IMAX. Uh, we're gonna, I'm gonna have fun at it. Yeah, and then we're we gonna go to our afterwards. our Ultra Lux Dream Loungers and hang out in that theater. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be a great time. Well, December twentieth can't come fast enough. Uh, Nerf herders, let us know what you guys thought of the trailer. Uh, if you guys have anything to add, let us know. If you have more trailers that you would like us to watch or react to, comment down below. We love going back in our podcast to reference uh, different comments that we see. Mm-hmm. Um, we just we just need more of them. Yes. It's yeah. Like if you have questions, ask happen. them to us. We will answer them in the podcast. Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah, may the force ca- be with you. The podcast can be found on iTunes. Can be found on Spotify. Can be found in uh, a couple other places uh, coming soon. But yeah, the two the two big ones, it's finally up there now. So awesome. So it all worked out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can find us there at Nerf Herders Assemble. You can find us on sure all social be media. Down here somewhere. Dolby, Cinema. 3D, or IMAX. Which one are you going to see? Not 3D. Dolby. Dolby would be pretty sweet. I, I can't I do like 3D. This. I can't. With me. I can't do 3D. Well, if it's not filmed in 3D, it's not worth seeing in 3D. So Dolby or IMAX for me. Well, we'll catch you guys later. On to the next trailer. <laughs>